Today's game is coming to you live from Luniapolis, Craziana. We're at Mucus Asylum Stadium, and the inmates are taking their medication along with their seats, sharpening their knives, and hopefully not listening to the voices in their heads. Pain, suffering, humiliation, and possibly a conga line. This game's going to have it all. The Nashville Lycans battle the insane Colts. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Grim Blitzrow with you along with my partner, former player Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. And his life partner, the mini mutant head that lives on the shoulder of Bricks Jr. Uh. Hey, you just threw up on my shoulder. I don't often drink beer, but when I do, I get totally shit-faced. I am the world's most intoxicated man. Say that again. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. And like bricks his balls, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. And it's first and ten. And they stack the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard. Second down and nine. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Now what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. That's a six yard gain on that catch. Third down and five. Results in an interception. Oh, with a brutal hit. <laughs> and it's first and ten. friends was an all-pro NFL hit second down and five they've called a zap attack oh he was hitting mid hurdle and fumbles the ball he's at the 40 he's at the 30 the 20 the 
Hamilton! And he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now. And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. He could go all the way. And it's first and ten. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. He took a beast boost injection. Now wants him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection. Oh, holy crap. He missed time the spikes and ends up dead. Life is full of misery, Grim. Loneliness, suffering, and then it's over much too soon. Second down, and he often says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. <laughs> Second down, and ain't gonna happen, partner. points you need to get them back here comes the kickoff let's see if they can make them pay no doubt about it that guy is dead he says i'm taking you with me this defender is not going to be stopped once he picked up that loose ball he was going to score or die trying luckily for him he scores <laughs> Turner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. 
They had the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. Right, the QB is going to have more interceptions than he just wrestles him. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Second and eight to go. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Oh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. I was high school and civil. I am a hell of a fellow. Third down and, well, good luck. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. Oh, no good. Now that punter's going to find it. No return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. Good throw, good catch, but not quite good enough at nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. And that'll bring up second and one. And the defense gets the quarterback for a sack. warming up and that'll be a first down you know bricks a lot of people have gotten pass happy in this league nice to see some old school mano a mano on the turf huh and it's first and ten He's a berserker because he's frothing at the mouth. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh, man, he just got skewered by those spikes. That was bloody and disgusting. Hey, anyone in the mood for steak kebab? Make mine rare. Touchdown! And he rolled that one into the end zone. Nicely done. I can't run like that unless it's coupon night at Taco Hell. He has better footwork though than me on a kind of not clenching his
And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. Watch out, the ball carriers brought a chainsaw to the field. Except for die. And it's first and ten. Catches it for six yards. Good hits on that play, Bricks. His fingers are like a bunch of sausages. And that'll be second down and four. And another interception. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. Oh man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and ten. Slice through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant rep. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And the offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. First and ten. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. And it's first and ten. Defense holds him to a four yard pickup there. Second down and six. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> And they'll line up for the punt here. Well, oh, no, that's a lovely shank for the punter today. He just and he's got a chance for a good return here. He could go all the way. Oh, sweet mother of fornicating monkeys! He was destroyed on that play. Oh, that's a very weird expression, Grim. You ever been in a monkey house at the zoo, partner? Disturbing to say the least. Just like this. First and ten. Boom, dead and down. You delivered the 
freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra. Oh, mama. Just call him Captain Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. And he's off to the races. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And it's first and ten. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. Second down and long. And the offense quickly calls their second time out. That's how you do it. Do what? Third down and long. He is fighting for every yard. That pass was good for 10 yards. They quickly call a timeout, hoping to save some time for their offense. This is going to be a long kick. Let's see if he can make it. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just getting the points and let's move on. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. That run is good for ten yards. There's a bloody red head on the field. Now that's their red penalty marker, Bricks. Looks like this one's coming back. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we are, Quinn. Aren't we are. Second down in. Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Quinn. But it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up? That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Well, this kick is no guarantee. Sure it is. If he misses, he's fired. Guaranteed. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. How? Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story. Here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. Oh, man. His neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's 
next? Oh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? The 10. And he picks up the loose ball and rumbles into the end zone for the score. Nice going. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. We are back for the second half as the teams line up for the kickoff. The coach told his players they'll be strung up on the goalposts if they don't make this a game in the second half. That's how you motivate these pricks. <laughs> when you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Second down in a very lot. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. How was it scrambles tomato soup? I forget, but a good scab tastes like bacon. Down my mouth. Mm-mm, a scab lettuce tomato sandwich. Sounds like a picnic. And the MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...